this here that in MK Ultra was a frequent thing and as you see as I posted the video is already here waiting this is coming out of the home for elderly people this is this is the way it is still this is the way it is Seems like, uh, I'm not even sure, maybe the driver was inside or what? Play with the lights. This always was the light that worked like this since, since from forever. I don't know why, but this light here, they always had one work like this. that you would have a light like this oh there is a there is a ambulance vehicle departing this this is truly was waiting on me for me to come and make his show basically So basically this shit is this is this stuff is what goes on here uh, already was in MK Ultra this is another hot hat who wanted to have a physical fight with me in fact not only this one but right here one at the burgers right across the street one maybe maybe two behind here and so on uh, supposedly there would be this kind of stuff that would intimidate me and then it would be a physical fight and so on But this shit is extremely annoying because it goes day and night, basically. It is annoying. Stuff like this, if you go anywhere you go, you try to go slip, take a rest, you're gonna have. This is what it looks This shit here, to make myself clear, this is done remotely, this stuff. This is not done by the light. You were able to see the light barely started. And once it started, it was solid. Well, you can trust me, the light, when I go cook, when I do the stuff, when I did, it was doing like this all the fucking time. So I know because of the talk they had, conversation they had during MK Ultra with the neighbors, if they can do for them this and that mentioning me literally a switch they would use so that it would go and the light would blink like this because of the problems wiring problems that they found in this house that they claimed that the house had a most severe wiring electrical problems during mk ultra 
uh, police claimed that the box would go off if you would place certain things in certain places. I am pretty sure that there is a little bit more than a bulb that is just bad. There is some other stuff that goes on. I am going to position the camera here. I'm going to let one run a little bit and see if I get some feedback. I will do it like this down, just as I could. So maybe I get a chance to give a good impression about what that looks like. Uh, to me, to me, this kind of stuff doesn't bother me, but what bothers me are memories on psychiatry's paper couch, on the police. They were completely taken over, absorbed when they used this stove here in our house to prepare food. Please help me see two chairs go or see you go. You tell me who's at the time. Then I should put the display to the fire. So two for you, two for you, two for you. No, two and four. Oh, I'm also not doing a question for us to speak now, but I will play as a bit of a tune with it. Change. What is that? Nine minutes, actually. Two and four, two, two and four.
tisti za del, konc, to je vse, kar je. Tu je lahko, zakaj ne, tudi, hvala. Stav, da če jo vsi hiljo, da je sa Bob, 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 This frequency work normally it never would be flashing the light. You see this, but they were playing with this kind of stuff during MK Ultra. Uh, heavily suggesting me it's going to be ambulance vehicle is coming for you, boy. The play with the lights started sometimes in 2005. Uh, there was mother outside that worked in the field. They must have been in 2005. Since 2005, they played. Now go and calculate how much that is. 17 years, 18 years. Actually, I did not do the whole thing because I know that this was a provocation. But let me do the whole thing. According to MK Ultra, it's going to be parked here and it's going to be a police that will come after you. So the guy apparently who had this car, I saw him, came out and then I make this a really, really loud here, this bar. He came from this bar out here, Simba, so.
this individual was involved in MK Ultra and stated it's going to be a witches who's going to give him something to eat so he will beat his drunkness and then he will come after me so guess what's going to happen tonight in this uh, incident I realized police was involved they had me they warned me about sitting outside psychiatrist Peter Kapsch was involved in this stuff they warned me about sitting outside of the bar and waiting for the police and that kind of stuff this is not isolated this is not just that this guy would be the one who would be doing this kind of stuff but this is a setup by the police so let's see how they play out this stuff Uh, the guy came out hurling at me, yelling at me, he was ready to fight uh, and it was the waitress that pulled him inside. From what I recall, this guy is about 1 meter 90 centimeters or even taller. Uh, he's a local farmer here and basically that's exactly what I need. Uh-uh, he disappeared. There's actually still the car outside there, but he did go and he turned off the lights. There is a group of people out there. It'll be interesting to see this. They were very loud inside of the restaurant. And it appeared to me that uh, in a restaurant which already should have been closed down long ago you see it's already now Monday and it's one o'clock in the morning past one o'clock in the morning and we still have this stuff going on the car however is still parked over there as you can see you can see the car is still parked there not supposed to be parked According to the police who came afterwards, because the shit is repeated, it was established that the car shouldn't be parked there. The car should have been gone. But more than anything, assaulting people while intoxicated inside of the restaurant, which should have been already closed long ago. It's really not a thing to do. Look, give a little more signal. Now let's see how the police joke turns out. Okay, the guy made a few threats. He was not that tall. He's not that tall. And then he sat in the car. And off he left. Uh, this appears are young kids, maybe graduation, something, I don't know. Supposedly they have a private party. But they really made themselves loud. You know, they complain about my walking on the street here. The thing is, I walked through here many, many times before. And not to my knowledge, it would be prohibited. It's the lady in her, maybe even 40s, drove her white Morris and asked me, why am I walking basically judging me at one o'clock in the morning? Fuck. Maybe police should place some table, something, board that would advise people not to walk through here.
at one o'clock in the morning. The guy also mentioned something about the Germans. I don't know. That I was uh, Nemitz uh, making myself kind of political, isn't it? That I was making myself uh, mute, that I wouldn't listen or whatever, what he had to say. Expressed want to see a public video from me. Uh, actually, a video from me, a recording, uh, and a further presented himself as a as a public person. As a public person. So. He wouldn't tell what kind of public person uh, when I stated him I am a public person. He just uh, had his friend asking in a threatening pose about what kind of public person is that I am. Now, that guy was a taller guy about maybe 185, maybe taller, who appeared maybe was not a client, but someone interested in having a physical confrontation. A lot of threats for the young kids. Uh, I think a mixed crowd of people, uh, young kids and uh, also adults completely, like maybe some high school, uh, but the guy who made himself look like a tough guy, it's not a high school. No, high school already passed him. Long ago, I think.